Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. In this short video, I'll show to you guys how you can download Google Drive on your PC and use it over there. The steps are pretty much the same if you are using Windows 10 or Windows 11. But in this case, I'm doing this video on Windows 11. So what you need to do, first of all, you need to open a browser and there you just type google.com and then you have to click over this grid here, which is regarding Google Apps. And from the options that you'll see over here, you need to choose Drive. If you haven't yet logged in, you just have to log in with your Gmail account and then you will be directly on My Drive page. You can also come directly on this page by just using this link, drive.google.com. I will put this link on the description below so you can come directly on this page. Once you have opened your Drive website, then you have to go over settings, which is this sign over here. And then you can see this option which says get Drive for desktop. We we'll click over here and now it will redirect you to this page where you can download Google Drive. And now we just have to click over this button here which says download drive for desktop now it will ask you where you want to save this setup file for google drive and once you browse to the location where you want and then you save it it's just 300 megabyte and once this setup file will be downloaded you just double click on it in order to install are you sure you want to allow this to make changes on the device yes Install Google Drive, add an application shortcut to your desktop, add desktop shortcuts to Google Docs, Sheets and Slides, install. Here we are. Google Drive now is installing on my computer. And the good thing about Google Drive desktop is that you don't have to open the browser every time that you want to edit something. You just locally edit everything that you want on your Google Drive and it will be synchronized with all the devices where you have Google Drive with this account. Sign in with the browser. Now it will ask obviously me to sign in. I'll choose this account to sign in. You can choose any account that you want. Make sure that you downloaded this app from Google. So it's just verifying that this is not a hacking or this is not a spam or whatever. We press over sign and success. You have signed in into Google Drive. To continue, close this window and return to Google Drive. So let's open now. Google Drive. So Google Drive successfully installed. All right, let's close it and let's see how we're going to use it. So we go at start and we just open File Explorer and normally we should be able to see Google Drive from this folders on the left. So once you have opened the File Explorer and here we are, as we can see now, Google Drive is over here. It's shown here on the left. You can go also over this PC and you can see that Google Drive is showing as a drive in my case. So we just click over here and here we can see all the files that you have on Google Drive. And actually it will help me a lot to clean up my PC because as we can see it's quite big and I need to clean up my PC. Just for testing I'm just going to put let's say this file and I'm just going to go once again over Google Drive and then I'll click over my drive and over here we can put the files that we want. And as we can see, actually, it's everything downloaded that I had already on my Google Drive on my PC now. It's a copy of it. So here it is, my drive. Those are the files that I had on my Google Drive on the web. And now those are all on my PC. And let's reload it and let's test it if this file that I just uploaded on Google Drive is already on the web synchronized. So here we are. This was the file that I just upload it locally on Google Drive and I can see it also on my web version of Google Drive. And all the files will be synchronized in all the platforms where you have Google Drive opened with the same account. Thanks a lot for watching and please consider subscribing to our channel. Wish to you all the best. Thank you.